So we're gonna start off with our tube. My favorite warm up with the tube, standing on it. So what I want you to do is hold it right about at your crotch. As much as we like to think our legs are this long, they're not. So the tube is gonna mimic our hip joint and our legs to add resistance, all right? We're gonna travel to the right, so let's move to the left. And we're gonna take four steps, big, little, big, little, watch me for a second, big, little, stretch, little, okay? So I don't wanna see, okay? Big, 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 four steps, ready, Let's go. One, two, three, four, and switch. One, two, three, four, go. One, two, three, four, again. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one more time. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, and four. All right. Squat drag. This time we're only gonna do two squat drags. Nice and wide, sumo. Open up, externally rotate those thigh bones. Squat low, drag it in. Squat low, drag it in, switch sides. Squat, drag, squat, switch. Unfortunately, those of us with carpet have lots of friction. Again, down and drag, go. Squat, drag, low, can you go? Nice and low. One more time, squat, drag, Squat and tube. Grab that tube. I was noticing, wow, everybody looks really clear today. And I notice I'm still wearing my glasses. So I can see when you cheat. All right, so step four times. Big, little, three, four, and switch. One, two, three. Four and switch. One, three, four and switch. One, two, three, four. One more time. One, two, three, four. Switch. One, two, three, four. And squat drag. Twosies. Ready? Toes out. Big stance and squat drag. Squat and switch, squat, drag, squat, switch, squat, drag, squat, switch, drag. Bring it back. Let's do it one more time. Squat, drag, go home. And grab that tube. Round three. Three is the magic number. So true, but funny story. Lincoln and I were doing a kid's workout together. I got a little distracted, started talking. He's five years old. He went like this to me. He told, pointed right at me, pointed to what I was supposed to be doing. I went, Nicole, your child just gave me the finger. And she went, <laughs> he went like this. He did this to me. And go. She goes, huh, I wonder where he learned that. It's amazing. They are watching you. So much for Big Brother. It's the children. The children of the corn we have to worry about. Five years old, he was calling me out for stalling. Again. 
And back. All right, squat drag. Ha! Ah, two big deep ones and down, drag, switch, switch, down, drag, switch. Again, two, go back. One more time. Switch. And water. Water, towel, mat. Good mornings and good morning to you. Stand on your tube there and there. So I'm going to get my tube about hip bone width apart, right there, okay? And we're gonna put it behind our neck, hold onto it, stick your butt out as far as you can. So my goal is to keep this tube, this portion of the tube, directly over my ankle. I'm not saying that I was gonna be able to do it, but that's my goal, all right? So I'm really thinking about pushing those hips back, 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 back. Feel the lengthening of the hamstrings, and then come on up, squeezing that butt. All right, let's do it. We're gonna do 15. Ready, and push, and up. Again, push those hips back, back, back. That's two. Push, 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 three. Push, 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 four. Push, baby toe down. Five, make sure you're not rolling the knees. Six, get off that big toe or the ball of your foot. Seven, push. Eight, push. Nine, push and find that hamstring stretch. 10, we got five more, push. Stretch, lengthen and up. Careful you're not rounding, hunching the shoulders or back. Almost there, push. And two more. Hamstring stretch, 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 stretch. One more time, push, 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 and up. All right, just take it out, bend those knees, and come on out onto the floor, on your hands and knees. All right, so. We're not gonna do fire hydrant right now. We're gonna do circles. So shoulders directly over those hands, abs are tight. My knee is gonna go forward, up, around, and down. Okie dokie, we've got 15 on each leg. And go, circle up, around, one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Switch sides and go. Remember, forward first, up and around one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and 15. Good mornings. All right, so this time I'm going to do it facing you so that you can see that I'm off, not off my rocker, but off my big toes. Bend and to prove my point, 
My knees will not roll in. See how my baby toes down, how my knees stay over the ankles? That's what I want you to do. So push, 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 one, push. Looking at my knees, two, look at my baby toe on the ground, and push, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen last time, and fifteen. Bend those knees, take it off, and on the floor, on your hands and knees. Again, circles. So we're on our hands and knees. Shoulders directly over those hands. Abs tight. And bring that knee forward and around. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Switch butt cheeks and go. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Oh, my butt. All right. I'll turn to the side again this time. Standing on top. And 15 is our number. Hold on one second. There we go. Make sure you're standing up securely. You don't want it slapping you in the face. Push those hips back. We go push. One. Push. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, push, 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 eight, number stay in the baby toe, off the big toe, nine, it's all about pushing the hips back, ten, lengthen the hamstrings, eleven, twelve, 13, 14, one more time, and 15. Come on down. All right, 15 and 15, here we go. Circle up and around, one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. All right, other sweet cheek. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15.
9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and water. One of my very favorite, favorite, favorite of all time exercises, cross back lunges. Okay, so there was a time I called them snappy crotch lunges, and here's the reason. If you get your heel off the ground, and you know we always have to have our heel grounded, right? If your heel comes up, I promise you it will roll up and snap you in the crotch, all right? Lesson learned. It has been done. I have witnessed it. So that heel remains grounded. Get off your big toe. Make sure that baby toe's down. Do you see how as soon as I put that baby toe on the ground, look at that nice, beautiful knee ankle alignment. So right leg's doing the work. So the right leg has the tube. Handles go behind your back. I really want you to take those elbows back. Open up the chest. Now, that other leg, tendu. Show me that point to the side, just like in ballet. Cross back. It's not just back, but it's back and across, and then come up. So our leg is going in a diagonal fashion. We do lots of stuff forward and back, and side to side. So now we're hitting different planes of the body, diagonal. All right, let's do it. 10 is our number. Cross back, one. Cross back, two. Three, and when I say back, I mean bring that body back. Don't keep your weight forward. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, uno mas, and ten, switch sides. Toes, toes are pointing forward, all right? They're not pointing this way because then we'd still be going forward and back, right? Toes are forward, hip bones, knees, chest forward. It's just this leg that is going diagonal. Ready? Tens our number. Cross back. One, keep your chest up. Two. Three, belly off your thighs. Four, stay on that baby toe in front. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, one more, and ten. Good. To the floor. So last one we did was face up or face down. So this time we're going to face up. So on your back, all the way down, hands by the hips. Go ahead and lift your hips nice and high. 20 is our number. One, two, squeeze that butt, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten more, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. Ugh. Back up, cross back lunges, level two. Right foot goes in the center, left foot out to the side, two behind. Open up those elbows. Now we're going to add or incorporate balance. Cross back, down, tap, balance, one. Down, tap, show me you have control. Down, tap, three. Down, tap, four. Down, tap, five. Down, tap, six. Seven, eight, 
nine, oopsies, and hold it, and switch. All right, plant, elbows back, chest up, tens are a number, go. Cross, tap, one, cross, oopsies, tap, two, cross, tap, three, cross, tap, four, cross, tap, halfway there, six, chest up, seven, do not lean into that leg, you don't need to lean to pick it up, stay tall, one more, stay tall, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, and down, back to the floor, oh my goodness, the balance part's easy, it's the walking part that's hard for me, okay, on our backs, Hand by the hips, 20 is our number, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. Ah, and up. Last round. Make sure I don't trip out of my way. So this time, that balance. No more tapping at all. Lunge straight into that balance. Right foot ready to go. And toes are forward. I'm gonna back up so that mat's not in my way at all. At all. Chest up, shoulders down and back. Here we go. Cross back straight into that balance. One. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, chest up, eight, ah, eight, <laughs> nine, and ten. Sorry about that. This is what I did. I rolled onto my big toe. I admit it. I made a mistake. First one for 2020. <laughs> All right, so baby toe stays down, Sandra. Here we go. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. There. So when I looked straight up, not down, I did much better. You know? Where the eyes go, the mind goes. Where the mind goes, the body follows. So if you're looking down, you're going down. So I kept my head up. 20 is our number. Ready, set, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten more. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. 
three, two, and uh, one. Water. Okay. Grab your tube. Wrap it around you. Now I'm going to put one foot in at a time. My toe goes in the handle and slide. Then my toe goes in the other handle and slide. See, I'm all hooked up for inner thighs. On your backs, legs up in the air. Now, if I want to make it harder, I can open my tube out so my legs come up. They're pulling against that added resistance. If I want to make it easier, I can also hold onto the tube and pull myself up, okay? So if it comes to that, just know these are there to work for you or against you. In the meantime, abs are tight, low back is grounded. Do you see how if my back is arched where my feet are? Get those feet over the hips, tighten the abs, push that low back down, and make sure those tubes do not become loose, the handles on your feet. All right, snug as a bug in a rug. Out and in, here we go. Out, I'm gonna hold it out. To this round, at least the first round, I make it harder. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten more. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Ooh. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Come on up. Now to come out of it, move your butt there. Off. On your side. So, on your side, stack your hips one on top of the other. Make sure the legs do not move, do not touch. So my top leg comes forward. As we get tired, this top leg starts to wander this way. This makes it a little bit easier. I want to make sure. Do you see how my legs are not touching? <clears throat> legs do not touch. Don't let them touch. So we're only going to lift up. Parallel. Parallel. That's it. Now with me, we have... 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. So my foot's not higher, it's not lower, it's parallel. I lost track. 4, 3, 2. Now hold it right there, right there. Externally rotate that knee, squeeze that butt tight. 3, squeeze it tight. 4, 5. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and switch sides. Here we go. Again, knees bent, top leg up. They do not touch each other here. And parallel to the floor. Up, that's it. Two, don't let them touch. Three, don't let them touch. Four, five, six, no rocking, no rolling. Seven, eight, nine, ten. So hold it right there. Squeeze that butt, rotate that knee. Two, really squeeze. Three, four, five, six. My range of motion isn't as good as the side. Seven, eight, nine, one more, and ten, and down. All right, on our backs, grab that tube. Inner thigh. Roll it, one side. Roll it, two sides. Around the waist, 
Scoot your booty down, legs up. I'm gonna push them out again. 20 is our number. Abs tight, low back is down. Ready, set, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten more, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Take it off. All right, on your side, one leg in front of the other. Don't let them touch, parallel to the ground. Again, don't lean backwards, keep those hips stacked. Chest, hips, face, all pointing in the same direction. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and hold it right there, and one, two, three, squeeze that butt, four, right there, five, six, don't lean backwards, seven, eight, nine, one more, and ten, switch sides. Stack, one foot in front of the other, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and hold it. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, yeah. Six, seven, I'll feel it, eight, right there, nine, and ten. And one more round, inner thighs. Roll it, roll it, roll it. All right, this is it. 20 and out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, keep that low back down, 16, 17, 18, 19, and oof, 20. Ugh. Off, 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 get them off. On our sides. Last round of these as well. And we're off. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one more. 10 and hold, one, two, three, four, five, six. For some reason I feel it better or more effectively if I put my hand on it. Eight, nine, 
10. Other cheek. All right. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold it. And one, two, three, four, five. Oh, doggy. Six, seven, eight, nine. One more. Ten. And water. You can put your tube underneath the leg of a couch. Rawr. Like that, so it's anchored underneath the leg of a couch or a heavy table, something like that. Or you could hold on to it with your hands. I'm gonna hold on to mine with my hands. Totally up to you. Oh, I'm gonna take my glasses off. Forgot, I'm still wearing them. And now I can't see you. So if you cheat, I have no idea. So I'm gonna put both feet in one handle. Stay on your knees, even if it is under the couch, stay on your knees, nice and close to that couch. Both feet go in, or both feet, both handles go on one foot. Roll them, roll them, roll them. I like to roll it on the floor, roll it. Make sure it's nice and snug. So I'm gonna use my hands like this, or you can have it on the couch, like we said. So it looks a whole lot like sliders at the moment, right? but it's not. We're doing rainbows. So straighten that leg. Watch me for one. We're gonna go, I'm gonna start off across. So I'm here straight back. I'm gonna start off across. My legs are gonna go up, around, up, around. So I'm making a rainbow, okay? So with me, get your one foot instead of straight back. Cross it over just a little bit. Here we go, up and over rainbows. Up and over one and back. Up and over two and back. Up and over three, back. Four, back. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. All right, and switch sides. Slide it in. Again, make sure it's nice and snug when you slide it in. I'm going to hold on with my hands. Oopsies. Snug, slide it in. Hands held. And that leg, it's not just straight back, but straight back and across. Now go up and over, making that rainbow. One, and back. Two, back. Three, and back. Four, and back. Five, and back. Six. Seven, whew. eight, nine, ten, and bring it back. Whoa. All right, take that off. Now we're going to work both butt cheeks at the same time. Go ahead, we're going to go into side plank on our elbows, lift those hips high. Straight out, that leg is gonna go up. Just like that. So our lower leg, you're gonna feel it in that hip to stabilize. Make sure your chest, face, shoulders, hip bones, everybody, everybody, everything pointing forward. Up and down goes this leg. 15 is our number. One, two, three, four, 
five, you should feel it already, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Oh, other cheek. So did you notice it's a two for one, not just the one lifting? So we understand intellectually this leg is working because it is going up and down, even though all you notice is the bottom. Trust me, they're both working. <laughs> Big muscles do the moving, little muscles do the stabilizing. Now, make sure that bottom doesn't start to stick out. We don't want to pike. Keep those hip bones forward. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, yay, 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 nine, ten, whew, eleven, almost there, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and that's our fifteen. Back to the tube. Oh. On your knees. Toe goes in both handles. Secure. Roll. Make sure it's nice and tight. I'm going to hold on to it here. All right. Again, so that leg goes straight up. Slightly across. Up and over. Make that rainbow. Up. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Oof. And switch. Roll it, nice and secure, hold on, take it back, slightly across, up and out we go. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Ah. On our sides. Oh, plank it. Chest, face. Hip bones forward. Pick it up. 15 is our number. One, two, three, four. Get that hip bone forward. Five, six, seven. I want to see that bottom hip bone. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and 15, Whew. other side. Okay, pick it up, get that hip bone forward and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, and oh, 15. Oh my goodness. One more round. Oh, it's funny. I honestly don't feel that much work. My leg went up and down, but I just noticed it wouldn't lift. <laughs> I was so preoccupied with the pain of the supporting leg. 
but I didn't even realize the pain the moving leg was in until it just stopped moving. It's like, huh, it was going higher before, I swear. All right, hold on to it tight, knees together, and take it back out, slightly across, and make that rainbow up and over. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, yeah, and then. Switch sides. Oh, did I mention? This is our last group of exercises. Yes, then we can stretch. Hands down. Oopsies, I'm crisscrossed. Hands down, leg back, slightly across. And rainbows. Up and over. One, two, three, four, five, six, yeah, seven, eight, nine. Oh, and ten. Off we go. On our side, it's a plank. Top leg is straight, bottom is bent. Come up, get that bottom hip bone forward. And here we go. Fifteen. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, five more, uh, twelve, ha, huh, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and switch. I was gonna hold it, but I couldn't. Okie dokie, fifteen, and then we stretch. Ready, set, up, get that hip bone forward. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, oh, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15 and done. Huh. Water. Water. Oh, crisscross applesauce. My hips. All right. So sit, crisscross, lean forward, stretch those hips. I can still feel them burning. Burn, baby, burn. Okay, so what I want you to do is take your left leg flat on the floor with your right hand, grab the outside of your foot, hold on to it there. So you're gonna take this foot, slide it away as far as you can, and I want you to feel a stretch along your right shoulder, waist, all the way down, all the way into that right hip, maybe even into the knee, as far as you can. If you can straighten your leg, great, but that's not necessarily your goal, okay? Your goal is to stretch this whole right side. Oof. I can feel it all the way down into my right hip.
and slowly come on release come on up oh. open your legs into a straddle now if you are struggling to keep your back upright elevate your butt get a yoga block get a book get a pillow something to pick your butt up it'll make it easier to sit upright okay now once you're already positioned that you're upright what i want you to do is take your tailbone point it to the wall behind you so rotating my pelvis my hip bones are forward tailbone back and leaning forward belly button to the floor or at least belly button downward oh and stretch that groin and inner thighs my inner thighs are going to be sore every time we do squat drags every time we do adductor adductors with that tube legs going spread them that makes me sore and we did them both and come on up bring that foot in i am not a fan of sore inner thighs Actually, I'm not, a sore, I'm not a fan of being sore, period. Bring it across. Always cracks me up when you all say, oh, I love being sore. It makes me feel like I did something. I know I did something. I was there the whole time. I don't need a reminder for the next one, two, three, or four days. Now, slide it out. And again, our goal is not necessarily to straighten this leg. If it goes straight, it goes straight. You probably just have short legs like me. But stretching all the way down into that hip and I actually feel it more in this knee than I did on the other side oh stretch Each time you exhale, see if you can go a little bit deeper, maybe straighten the knee a little bit more or bring the chest closer to the floor, whichever. Just make sure you keep that hand on the outside of the foot. Don't let it come in, go all the way out. And slowly come on up. This time, instead of a straddle, bottom of your feet together, right out in front. Bottom feet together, hold on. Sit nice and tall. And elbows push the knees down, nose to the toes. and up take your left leg across the right try to get that right cheek down take a lied left foot across the right both cheeks down right hand pull that knee in so i'm bringing that knee opposite knee as shoulder pull it in feel that stretch on that left cheek Sit up tall, and, and if you can't sit up tall on this, put a wall behind you. Just scoot your booty right against a wall. That'll help you stay upright. I don't want you fighting to stay up. I want you fighting to pull the leg in. That's where the battle is won. Now, opposite elbow hook. Bring it over and twist. Oh. Each time you exhale, rotate just a little bit more. Whew. 
and center. Now stack your knees, one on top of the other. Ah, stack those knees, kind of like a just squirm, and then forward. Stand up. Now, before you go anywhere, bring that bottom foot forward. Now stack one ankle, <laughs> and the knee, trying to get to the other ankle. So, I am in a triangle position. My pelvis is the point, and then my knees go out, and then I'm trying to stack my shins parallel, one on top of the other. Stay up nice and tall. It will eventually go down. It takes me eh, about a minute, but it does eventually go down, opening up those hips. Ankles and knees in alignment. Shins stacked, one on top of the other. Both cheeks down on the ground. Almost there. And let's go ahead, unstack those legs. Ah. Take your right leg across the left. Get that cheek down on the ground. Hold on to it. Ooh, my butt's already sore. So we're gonna pull knee to the opposite shoulder. Pull it in, and again, if you have to sit against the wall to hold yourself up, that is fine. Again, the most important part is pulling this in Feeling that stretch. Nice and tall. Whew. Now you're going to take opposite elbow across. Rotate. Each time you inhale, lengthen that spine as you exhale. Rotate a little bit more. And slowly come on back to center. And then stack your knees one on top of the other. Wiggle. <sighs> Stand up tall and then forward. And up. Now, that bottom foot, pull it out. And then stack your knee over the ankle, ankle over the knee. Oh, I promise you this is going to go down. It just takes a minute, literally. Ah, relax your shoulders. Stay up tall if you got that wall behind you. That's helpful. Starting to drop. There it goes. See? See? I knew it would go. One side is always better than the other. OK, 
Continue to sit up tall, don't slouch. As tempting as slouching may be, don't do it. All righty. Guess what? We made it. Another day. Let's see if we can let go and hold it there. Circle shoulders back. Three, two, one. Take a deep breath up. Out. Big social distance hug. Kiss, kiss. Have a great day, and I will see you soon. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, I can't get up. <laughs> I'll crawl.